juice. Proud Engels. Uh, yeah, I just don't want to sound like some Roy Neck who's trying to speak Afrikaans because it's nothing more att- oh, unattractive or attractive, actually. Can both of you just quickly clap in front of your face. <laughs> <laughs> Once. Oh. Uh, One each. So go. Yeah. Perfect. And then you can start. Thank you. Very bossy. Oh, I love it. I'm definitely using that. <laughs> 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 you it's mean you're rolling? Horse. He's already rolling. You want the applause. Okay, so let's get it. Okay. For my sit, Jan van Riebeek and Drag. Wow! She is patient zero. It's Lily fucking slap silly. Hi, dad. Goeiedag, jy is Engels nou. Ek is heel te maal beling goeie. Jy lieg vir my. No, I can speak English fluently as well. Jou favorite Afrikaanse woord? Is pile. Pile. Dit is prachtig. Kry jy, kry jy, nee, 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 dit is my show, ek sal praat. Kry jy enige pile? No, clearly I don't have a script, so you just carry on. It's my show, ek sal nou. I do, I get pile all day, every day, and how do you think I smile so widely right now? It's because there's still something left behind from last night. Oh, no, stop it. So happy with the leftovers. Yes, no, 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 takeaways, man. Okay, where do you get them? Beefcakes? No, it's called Canal Walk. <laughs> Cubicle two. <laughs> That's amazing. Oh, Lily. So, mm. when did you start doing drag? Be honest. Uh, yes. Okay. Well, it was during the. Oh, fuck my list. Did leave I leave the big I brought, black no, stuff alone? This huge, expensive diamond. Oh, yes, it's um, giving ring. sheen. From the Kimberly diamond. Yes, it's giving sheen. <laughs> the only thing that's giving sheen is way too much sheen on your cheek. Um, so, <laughs> no, I started doing. Um, I don't know if you ever saw one of the Laurel and Hardy movies. I was. Uh, Honey, si- age it gap? was a silent movie. Age gap. Oh, oh there is a bit of an age gap. I know, you never say. Um, so, no, I started in 1995 uh, at um, a place called the Pump House, the Pump House. <laughs> Too out was I was 25. You weet, ek was in 1993 geboor. 1995, calm down. And so, sorry, these huge swimmer shoulders of mine keep bumping this (laughs) very cheap microphone. So, um, uh, it was uh, a venue called the Pompeys in the waterfront. And David Kramer, the guy that wore the red schooner. Yeah, yeah. yeah, Just not as glitzy as that blouse. But um, anyway, and he asked me to put together a drag show. Um, at the Pompeys, and yeah. I said, sure. Anyway, one of the drag queens turned out to be a complete boos, and we had to fire him. <laughs> so I, my sister said to me, you can do that. You did school plays. You can do that. So I was like, oh, okay. So I I did it. I, I did the show. I did the first. It was only supposed In to be... In 1995. Five. It was only supposed to be for Christmas. It was called Mince, Supermodels of the World. RuPaul had just come out... Um, as being fabulous, as yes, oh. as being as being black, <laughs> and <laughs> I was like, "Who's black?" Um, and um, and also that movie um, with the desert, oh, Titanic. That, no, 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 there's no desert in the Titanic, babe. Just a big the one I watched. The one, was yes, a yes. Big. Oh, the one when they went into the pyramid. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, uh, I never was it saw ice, that. Ice bar, was yeah. it a pyramid? Yes. Anyway, yeah. so anyway. all right, shame. Anyway, this, so I'm, I'm <laughs> honestly just getting piles talking about this. <laughs> so yeah, I started doing that show, and it was a huge <laughs> international success. Okay. And because uh, we went and performed once in the Seychelles mm. for some. Um, some Saudi sheikh and took us seven years to get out of there. But we b- were back. And then, um, yeah, so I started off and the show was called Mince. And it was with another drag queen called Kieran Legacy, who is hugely successful at the moment, um, <laughs> yeah, doing another life. But anyway, yeah, so that's <laughs> where it started. And I, and I, it's just never start. It's yeah, Mince. I do eat mince. I do love me some mince briani. How do you prepare your mince? I just prepare it by um, having a glass of water beforehand and then just... <laughs> fr- fr- <laughs> okay. Raw. Like yeah. I can see you eat just raw, raw meat. Don't I, I, be disgusting and vulgar and... Uh, 
so like a, what do you it, mean what? i don't know you like the long island island medium but just okay. much and you like fucking taller. sex sex on the Rock. pavement not <laughs> even the fucking <laughs> rocks <laughs> oh. anyway um. let's let's be serious let's try was it you ooit gefreest for your life no Nog nooit. Nee, as a drag queen? Yes, not, not even in 1995. No, never. Never afraid. No, no, no. And listen, 1995, be, just bear in mind, young kijkers, uh, there was no YouTube, internet, what's up? There was no tucky tucky. There was nothing in those days, babe. Mm -hmm. I mean, I had no reference. My drag reference was Peter Dirk Ace. <laughs> oh. um, <laughs> just from a makeup point of view and stuff, you know. So obviously, I was very... Very glad when the first tutorial came out <laughs> um, on the YouTube. It was the first thing I typed in was earthquakes. Yes. I don't know why I'm fascinated by earthquakes. Fascinated. Are you? Wacht, was it the first thing that you had YouTube? It was earthquakes. Earthquakes, yeah. Wow. yeah. I don't know. I just I find them why. fascinating. Wow. We've never had one here. Okay. And then I went to Bali a couple of years ago and I was in an actual earthquake, a 6.8 on the Richter scale. Yeah. And, um, and it shows I, on your face. <laughs> it, 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 <laughs> Hey, my skin's still wobbling. <laughs> yeah. He's such a an absolute comedy queen. Yeah. So, man, so with other words, he was like, "Nooit bang for your money, money, lich, lich." I was never scared for my life. Okay, but as the result is, with other words, it it iemand al ooit probeer jou skade aan doen? No, never. I've never had anybody get weird with me at all. I'm a big girl. I wouldn't mess with me. Mm -hmm. Would you? Today, I will, I will, because would, if they will see, if Asla can see what I see, yes. what under your waist and yes, I know, <laughs> then I they know. will know. And if you ever pan that camera down, <laughs> not that you have the budget or the facilities <laughs> to, to do, do that, I will take this one. Well, fucking that clap fucking you plug. Out. Oh, wow, well, beautiful, no, beautiful this silhouette. This is what happens behind uh, the scenes. Buy a moya ox, good boss. Steve Madden. No, no, no. no. It's, oh, this yeah. is from Thailand. Oh, yeah. Washed up on the beach after the tsunami. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing. So, yeah, yeah. Travers going like iemand's a paal. Oh, ma, it had some glitter on it and a little bit of some... Afrikaner ma, so skoen it. <laughs> it is giving Afrikaner mom really? during washing day. I mean... You would know. I, w I would. You My would ma's... Afri it's, Your it's, hair looks very nice. I love that you've coloured this blonde, babe. But did it burn? It burns when you dye it. Like when I went ginger, because I'm what actually is, also blonde. What is burning is my eyes. I just want to oh. come back to um, your, <laughs> your child. Grappy, I really do love you. Do you? I really do. I find you. I find you. You're one of the few, and I'm going to be shady now. But I was by a man drag queens in the land with actual talent. Well, you have actual talent. Well, thank you kindly. Not that you need my, you know, approval. No, but you I have. don't, and I just, I, I, I don't. But I'm grateful for it, and I'm, I'm never vindicated. Mm. I think that's been a good thing. On a serious note, is that I've never got to. For Baruch and thought I was too fabulous for my own nonsense. Because I just know that all of this washes off at night and we just look. <laughs> oh, and also, uh, why I have written, um, it's again not shady, but y you became successful without the internet. And that is fucking, it Ooh, takes balls. That was when it was still word of ma. Ah, ah, oh. <laughs> Please. Right, let me just take the sponge. No, that was when it was still word of mouth. Though, so when you actually, my first show, I had to hand out flyers in nightclubs in full drag. And I was convinced that I looked like a girl. And the bouncer in one of the clubs that we went into to hand out the flyers went, good evening, sir. Just hold on before we let you in, sir. If he said sir one more time, I'd made <laughs> so much effort. But I did have a suit jacket on belted at the the waist, mm -hmm. which was not very feminine. And we still put flyers underneath car windscreen wipers. Okay. But why why drag? Don't you have I'm, other talents? Other, but, but no, it's, can you summer do? I, yeah. I, well, because David Kramer asked for a drag show. Yeah, but you um, could have stopped there. I know. I was making way too much money, honey. I was like, hello, ka-ching, buy a house five years later. Bought a house from dressing up with my cock stuck way up my, the back of my bra and under the wig as well. This is where my cock is now. 
Het is nog ons hart hier as jy jouself, ja, as jy jouself spyker en jy moet vir jouself vraag, is dit in? I know, <laughs> I know, imagine if that was actually something that had never been said before, that, that, <laughs> you know, imagine. that was I like know, an original, original. <laughs> I know, or me, you know, I steal yes, everybody's exactly. comedy, plagiarism, <laughs> man. Exactly. oh you gosh, but point is, yes, the, what's the point, point is, being a drag queen in this country, yes, do you have opinions about being gay currently? Um, like, what do you mean? I mean, I one, don't think that we are sitting here with someone with experience, right? Well, I, you know, I think we're living in an amazing time. I think that the young gay girls and boys and trans and them, they, thus, thou, uh, are very blessed to have all this. Uh, these outlets, social media outlets in which to express themselves. Mm -hmm. And it's not such a big deal anymore. And it never was during my life. And a guy actually came to me after one of my shows in Durban and said, I'd love to do a documentary on you. And I, I got so, yeah. So I thought, oh, my, finally, my moment. Mm -hmm. And he was like, I just want to shoot like the struggle that you had growing up as a gay boy and going to like Plumstead High School, which we all know is a rough butch school and what you went through and the bullying and all that stuff and I was like oh I'm the wrong girl I was the bully I didn't have I didn't have any of that I, I wouldn't it almost happened and I, I in my little 13 year old brain thought I have to nip this in the bud now because this will carry me through the rest of my school career. If I've got to be bullied in front of all these nukhis, it's not going to be pretty. So I boo, got back straight away. And, but I've never been, I've never been, but I've never had a hard time being amazing. <laughs> Sham, have you? Has it been hard for you? But you don't want to be a, a woman. No, no, I have not. Listen, I'm, I think that if anybody would like to be a girl, you go, girl. But what you should maybe do is two years of drag and you probably will change your mind. <laughs> You'll change your mind because the lust and the frutile and the and now that I'm getting older and trying to achieve that natural look, obviously I, I put on glitter today because, you know, I'm doing a special <laughs> thing. But normally it's smoky eye um, and just natural colors, muted. But, um, yeah, it's a lot of hard work. trying, And that's why I've got so much respect for real gals. Uh, is that, does that sound horrible? What, real that? gals? Just chicks who have to get up all day, every day, um, and, it's, and put this mask on. It's a whole war paint mask thing we're doing. But I don't know, I began drag doing it. There was something in me that I got confused sometimes because I really do enjoy all this. Yeah. And then when I take it off, I feel ugly. Well, babe, and I, I can't believe you just said that because I went to a friend's birthday party the other night and I've been in drag almost every night of the week on jobs. Thank the Lord for the work. Bye, Don Quixote. Um, and now I'm going out as a boy and I stood and did my final check in the mirror before I went to the party and thought, oh, go to bed, just go to bed. Like I just, this, I'm like, as a boy, I'm just not, like I'm so used to seeing this yeah. paint circus thing. That it, it, that I've been struggling with. Only recently have I been struggling with the with going out to Joel as a boy. Because I'm this liberates you on a different level. It gives you confidence, but you invite a yeah. fucking eight as a man. But, well, no, I actually don't. I really lack lack. I always have lack co confidence as a boy. But but and to be able to paint the look I want, I can paint myself younger. I can, believe it or not, I can paint myself tanned. When are you going to do that? <laughs> <laughs> not this week. <laughs> Um, shame. I don't want to blow up the internet on your know, <laughs> channel of your nine followers. But I really no, I know there's ninety nine point nine 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 followers. <laughs> follow Shame. Follow Tali. It's Tali. Hey, Stick to so, the fucking script, no, bitch. Go on. Oh, there is no script, babe. There is. There is. No, it fell off the front of your wig. <laughs> that's uh, the, the notes. Anyway, so yes, I'm battling a little bit with that because I've been in drag a lot. That I'm feeling all fabouche and. And, like this, and then going out as a boy, I'm like, woo, woo, you know. Yeah, but, but I can't even, but you are denying a certain part of drag. Yes. Uh, meaning that, that there is hate. 
Oh, yes. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I see your lives. I see my lives. Yes. Even on TikTok Live. Yes. I watch one of your lives. And because you you are new on TikTok, <gasps> yes. you, didn't, you didn't block the homophobes. No, I don't know how to block so them. So you get them. And they were going, one was going, Satan, Satan. Like, they didn't stop with the whole I love them when they capital. go, dude. Hello, dude. Oh, yeah, yeah. like that's going to offend yeah. me. As if we don't know. As if we like, I, yeah, like, I, you know, like, what do you think I'm sitting on? It's yeah. not a cushion. <laughs> um, but then someone was going, Satan, Satan. I said, no, it's not. This is poly, I think poly on cotton. It's not satin. Well, you, somebody's typing satin. <laughs> Who's typing satin? I thought that was my little moment. I don't know how you do it because you, you, I went on TikTok when TikTok first started, like yeah, you yeah. did. Yeah, yeah. Um, and it was kind of locked down. Yeah, yeah. And I went on, I was trying to figure it all out. Anyway, accidentally posted th- this video. <laughs> you know, like, and I mean, look, the algorithms are pretty incredible because everything that showed up after I posted that was people with like downs. <laughs> People with what? Uh, like Down syndrome. Oh, like, and, yeah, okay, yes, yeah, and okay, like, um, you have like, yeah. mental health issues. Because yeah, yeah. they'd seen my first video, which was me trying to figure out how to edit or put a filter on. And I didn't realize that there's a thing between, difference between draft, post, public. I don't, anyway. You're just fucking the, posted the first everything. Video like that. So I landed up for like a week having that algorithm. <laughs> I thought, ah, does it go cock? And then I went on to Facebook and off I went, you know, for, for my lockdown. I should have stuck with it. But you can use Facebook more than any other social media. Insta and Face are, are, and YouTube are my three go-tos. Mm. But I am starting to frittle around with um, the Tiki Toki. Mm. So if you want to follow me on TikTok, <laughs> do. <laughs> is jij, is jij, ik weet, ik heb de vrees als een quote-unquote comedy queen yes. every now and again. Is dat mensen mij gaan cancel? Do you have a... Because you, you, you're not afraid of the homophobes. No. Are you afraid of cancel culture? No, I'm not. Maar je was amper gecanceld, jou bitch. Was For jy what? Nie? Was For what? Was het wat joke? Was het nie? Oh, 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 oh. oh. Mm. Yes, okay, so, yeah, just a little backstory. Yeah. I just, I was doing... I did five characters during um, COVID because everybody had a phone attached to the end of their arm and I did this... Um, Brown girl, Lynette tells us like Claudia Macy, <laughs> and she was very funny, and she was getting great views, and everybody was getting good views, um, and but uh, that and the Jewish chick Beryl Cowan, those were the two that hit, um, and my audience is very brown based. I'm a Cape Townian. It's like my thing. I, you know, if you shake my family tree, a claw is going to fall out. I'm just saying, mm-hmm. and a Jew, and um, an albino <laughs> probably as well. <laughs> Which I love and a Roy Cook for sure. Anyway, so I um and I did this video and then C- Cyril Rama yeah, yeah. was on and he did a very long speech which everybody bitched about. And I just looked at the little auntie in the box that was doing the sign language mm-hmm. and I thought, Oh, shame, isn't she bored? And then I thought, Oh, that's clever. I'll do a video with me in the box being bored. In fact, I'll be so bored, I'll fall asleep in the middle of my thing. Um, which was hilarious. Posted it, got thousands of views within f- like 45 minutes. My sister phoned and said to me, that is genius. And it actually looks like you're doing sign language. I said, but did you find the part where I fell asleep hilarious? Because that was the yeah, joke. Yeah. And actually, Sybil, Cyril does, <coughs> he does a little, <coughs> at some point, was very unattractive and she wakes up and carries on <laughs> signing. Anyway, the dwarf people saw it. They got involved. And off they went, and I had to write a letter of apology, take the video down. I didn't have to, but I chose to. Take the video down, do the whole thing. And then I still said to – I found the CEO's details of um, Def S, and I sent him a, like a really beautiful voice note to say, I'm so sorry about this whole uh, – it was never my intention and blah, blah, blah. And then I told my sister, and she went, bitch, you yeah, sent him a, a voice, voice note? note? You are fucked up. I'm a mess. You are fucked. A, you are fucked up. Mess. How do you have a career still after that stunt? I do, and it's just booming as we speak, and especially after this. Um, what do you call this thing? Podcast. Pod- pod- podcast. Yeah. Yeah. Pod- <laughs> so you're not afraid of cancel culture after I'm that no, whole incident? No, you know what? I think if we were all smart and clever, which I think you are, I still don't know you well enough, but you will always be able to make a dollar. 
doing something, whether it be writing or promoting something or directing something or well, guiding. Well, I don't or, care to offend people. We are fucking drag queens. That's yeah, almost our purpose. Yeah. Look, I, I, there's a few topics that I'll just stay away from because it's just easier. Yeah, yeah. But um, it, it's going to be offensive. It's going to offend somebody. And some people come to a show wanting to be offended. I literally had, and this is, I've, I've been heckled. In, I don't know if you're getting heckled yet. Have Sometimes, you, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've been heckled and I'm pretty good at handling a heckler. <laughs> but some nachi the other night actually went, blah, 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 blah. blah. <gasps> Gee, will you ever fucking shut up? Blah blah. I know, babe. I was, I was like, is it for me? I literally froze. He went blah blah blah. Will you ever oh fucking God. shut up? And I was like, okay. Uh, 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 I mean, a good it question. Me, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's a, it, I know some people also just wish to go back to sign. You know, go sign back to language. science. Do sign language. Oh, sign language. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Listen to my voice note. Um, yeah, so yeah, I did get a bit of a script and I did a script and I said to him, listen, you need to shut your mouth because this one's making money. Yeah. Money. <laughs> honey. Okay, well, that's fucking amazing. But, but uh, this is for my swear. Uh, as I look at how people react to drag, you know, how they react to it. What do you want? That's for my question. When it comes by, as people now drag queens a show to come and offend it, I'd stop. What the fuck? Did you expect a church service? Yes. What did you expect? Yeah, well, like I often think to myself, where do you think you are? Yeah. If people are offended by my show, where did you think you came to tonight? You're not at the Dross. That's for sure. <laughs> well, You're I'll not coming it. to see... Yeah. I'm not doing any of that. I probably could if there was a song I could lip sync to. Yeah. <clears throat> but um, <laughs> I, I'm doing the best I can. I try and not, you know, just be insulting and like cheap shock tactics, you know. No, but but, but sometimes people, you can, I've seen lips just get really thin in the audience and I'm thinking, oh, okay, read the room, bitch. You clearly don't want to go there. Mm. This is not the crowd. Yeah. And then I've got enough tricks in my handbag to dip into those. But the confidence level, how do you cope? I am no, this is all about you. <laughs> this, I mean, it's all about me. So, yeah. <laughs> Old hands. Um, <laughs> how do you, have you been heckled? Have you been, have you had like no, any? That, that kind of stuff makes a show interesting to me. Yeah. And it's what, funny enough, that those kinds of moments is what people talk, uh, this part of the part. So, who you die, 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 that's usually then the highlight of the show. Yeah. So, they give you content. Yes. Uh, I'm almost like the, the haters, or the, but it's never haters, it's people that's drunk or like people that feels like, oh, they have the confidence now yeah. to be part of the show yeah. or whatever. I, I've always felt, babe, and I don't know how you feel, I'm already calling you babe, I'm feeling so comfortable. <laughs> I'm still calling you pussy. Yeah. <laughs> no. Oh God. Anyway, but I always feel, feel is that too much? That's too yeah, much. Babe. I won't. I mean, you went right in front yes. of my camera when you did that. Now, I'll do. Please see me in synergy. Um, I uh, there's three things that I think <clears throat> can be trouble. One, just a technical nightmare when a show is technically not in sync: lighting, sound, staging, production. Audio, mm -hmm. one, two. Um, if that's all not <laughs> working, that's for Nikki backstage. Yeah. Um, if that's not working, problem. A uh, uh, language barrier. I've had people at my show that are from all over the world, God bless them, coming to see a drag show because they're just going to think it's... Death think drop it's, or whatever. Yeah, and yeah. I, I don't do that unless I'm in an actual hospital yeah. or close to a para... M medic, paramedic, paramedic. There you go. <laughs> I just can't help myself today. Um, and the other one is if people are drunk or on dwellums. I yeah. can't compete with that. It's all about them. It's also very unfair to do that. Like, yeah, well, if why fucking... would you come to a show and get off your theater? Because, like you said, you're not at a theater. Uh, yes. So the full yeah. of a full of can cancer. It's a drag show. Yeah. Let's buy. Yeah. The if whole it was that show. If club drag and you knew it was going to be death drop and silence, sashay I mean, sure, and yeah. shantay and slay batch. I don't do that. I need to communicate my show's storytelling. I do observational comedy. Yeah. You need to concentrate. You need to shut up. Yeah. You let me do my thing. So that's what I can't compete with that. Those are three things that I just I battle with a little bit. So 
Um, but I'm getting better at it because stand-up is still very new for me. I used to just lip-sync. Uh, not just lip-sync because it's a, you know, I lip-sync to really difficult stuff. If you saw any of my old, there would be like yeah. scatting, yeah, not yeah. the filthy scatting. Jan Pirevit one you did was the one, really Yes, difficult. yes. And yeah, it was really far, yeah. 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 Um, You're really good. Sheila Kalenta, Dventus Vabai. Um, what the fuck is do, that? I know. Uh, can you Google it? Because uh, I think she's dead. I think she was the crying auntie. Um, <laughs> oh, could I a kiss? Uh, I don't what? know. Just uh, hear uh, Linda, 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 Linda. Linda. Please comment below if you know exactly which song that is. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Okay, You're getting, getting good at this, Linda. bitch. You're really getting this the, social I'm, media. I'm, I'm, comment I'm below. Working. I know. I've been googling yes, it yes. on the U of Choose. Comment her age. Guess her age in the comment section. Yeah, anything over 50, you guys are wrong, wrong, wrong. <laughs> <laughs> you don't get that lovely palette that we've got from Essence Macolage. Not sponsored. <laughs> Not sponsored <laughs> yet. in this thing yet. But yeah. if they were clever, they would just. We don't need the makeup. We just need cash. Yes. Um, just Fuck give me the mind. rons, yes. actually. Yes. yes. Um, babe, but, any embarrassing moments that you've had? Oh, so, many. Have, have you? Already? No, many, but it's not It's not you're still new, hey, babe. I, yeah, compared to me, like, how yeah. long have you been doing this for now? Two years. Oh, babe. One year. Girl, one year, one, and, a half, one and a half. I was still using cokey pens for my eyebrows because that's... Well, I think my most... My, my embarrassment comes from... Ons was now in a kerk store place there sales, but it was in a book. We ons het geslaap reg langs die keierplek. So tot een hierdie ochend het ons gewerk kaptein. <laughs> and, and literally the next, mo- the next morning, day, I had a fucking show. So I had to sleep through kaptein <laughs> and perform the next day. And then, of, of, jy, jy kom by venues aan en, I mean, daar is geen... Buy a venues as a book, they don't know what you need as a drag artist. So yes. that's also my fault because I don't communicate yes. my needs. Yes. You know, yes. I that's need a, a room thing. where I can make up, for yes. example. It's a big thing. Um, or I don't well, want to be in the sun when I before, you know, yeah. those that, kinds uh, well, of things. Well, that's one thing that I want to do on my TikTok or YouTube channel is switch it to. Adv- I'm at that age now where everybody wants me to be their mother. I'm not in the mood to do that. But I'd love to give people advice and stuff. But I, I hear what you're saying because mm. I did a gig at, um, it was the, the barnyard and the, the performers actually sleep up in the roof. Uh, that's how the building's been designed, these barnyard theatres. Um, and you could hear them skinnering. Like, while you're doing your chafret, before you do the show, you can hear people going, yes, okay, now the one's actually had her tits cut off. Like, we, I know she's had, she's had, no, no she's not, not cut off, sorry. Oops, sorry. <laughs> um, uh, uh, the I, I, one's definitely had her tits done. No, you can see on stage, definitely something. <laughs> she's probably, I think she's going to go through the change. Mm. Because in those days, they would call it the change. It wasn't as clever as what we are now. Yeah. <laughs> um, no haters. Um, so I would hear all of that stuff but i but so the giving your client a brief of what you need technically yeah. visually yeah, yeah. money getting your dosh in advance huh? all that stuff i've learned a million and do you good self yes ma'am i've got an agent who handles my diary now but i worked as a model booker for many many years booking new talent in a model agency so i've under it's very, it's the same thing Pretty much the same. There's hair, there's makeup, there's collections, there's, you know, getting money. It's it's the same kind of thing. Do you want to die in a wig? No, 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 no. I would like to wrap this up at some point and pass it on to you. To, no, um, to pass it on to somebody else who's, you know, got a fumigating service to get rid of all the mickeys that are cropping around you. So, right wait, 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 wait. yes, and he will stop, you know, No, 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 no. I'm, well, I'm going to keep doing it until I, I you know, I, I think I'm clever enough and, and not so vinchat enough to know your numbers up, bitch. Like, you can't, like, you, you look at somebody like um, Dame Edna Everidge, who 86 years old is still, was, shame, she's yeah, she's dead not, now. May she rip. But <laughs> she was going on until she was well into the triple digits. Mm-hmm. Um, so I'd like to, you know, if, I, I, I think I will know when it's like, mm, girl, no, no, not a good look anymore. I mean, it's, uh, just getting back to the embarrassing moments, can I tell you one? It's yeah, yeah, literally, yeah. Please, it's brand please. new. Yeah, it's yeah. Brand yeah. new. Nice. I've ha- had lots. I've fallen on stage. I've I've had a tooth come out. I've like I, I've had stuff happen on stage. Um, <laughs> but oh, that was uh, <laughs> that was that was very... my boy laughing. <laughs> <laughs> so um, that's, that's why I love editing. 
That's not going to be it. <laughs> it's, it's um, it's anyway, so <laughs> Anything I like do look this shoe, job and I'm wearing a black leotard with a beautiful black frock that blah, blah, blah. In, in, uh, don't, I was going to say Google it because it's there. Mm -hmm. um, and, and afterwards I was doing the meet and greet and there were hundreds of people waiting for pictures. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm feeling my oats and I'm looking like, blah, and the skirt's split open. I'm like, oh. Mm -hmm. Love you. Oh, thanks so much for coming to the show. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, for, anyway, I get into bed, wash the confrere off, and now I'm going through the pictures very vain. Um, it's not actually vain. It's just, just like, oh, are they posting? And people are now starting to post the pictures with Lily from the meeting. Yeah, meet. yeah. And I am busy looking. I always look at my makeup. Like, is the make? Is did the makeup read properly? Is it like still fresh after the show? Because the meeting week's after the show, and I suddenly look at this. Like a thing, like uh, next to my guava, like, like, and I zoom. I'm not over it yet. Hold on, it's still new for me. <gasps> and you zoom. I zoom in. I've got a gun. My gun has come undone, and it, it's no bad. It's hanging out the side of my panty. I mean, it's it is so unattractive, like a roid, like a hemorrhoid on the front. Maybe you just have like an extended clit. Maybe that's what you. You must have spent. Girl, the, I just wish I had somebody put glitter on it. And then I was going through <laughs> all the pictures. I was up until three as the people were posting. Going, oh no! Delete, delete, cl 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 edit, cut, chop. My whole guava was hanging out the side there. Sonder glitter. Well, it was a beautiful. I think this is a more transition. Oh. I have I have something to sort out with you. Yes. You know Alita Francina de Kok? Oh, I love her so much. Well, she blocked you. I know she blocked and me. And here's why. I know why she blocked Let me. Let me send you. So explain this to the people, please. Explain this. Mm. So here's a photo of you taking a screenshot of one of her videos. Yes. <laughs> and you said, cooking with camel toe is a... <laughs> <laughs> well, babe, and you zoomed in on her. Face. I thought it was hilarious. I thought it was hilarious. <laughs> it is. But, babe, this is a girl that I'm obsessed with, and that that even sent me a happy birthday wish. Wish via well, my I fan. Get, this is your moment. Give uh, look into the camera and say sorry, Aleta, Aleta for, for Francina, showing her camel toe to us. I just thought you had enough. Um, no, no, comedy. no, no, no. I thought she was, she'd find this hilarious. I, listen, I also sent it directly it to her, hilarious. Francina de Kork. I didn't send, I could have posted this with my 40 odd thousand <laughs> followers, but I sent it to you directly because <laughs> I thought you would repost it because you would think it was hilarious. But, but have a look. Is that not a camel toe? <laughs> or is this something that you want to tell us? Because by you, I'm word, I would never, ever offend somebody who's brave enough <laughs> to get that out while they're cooking mussels and shave their entire head and you look fucking beautiful and I still love you <laughs> and I watch your videos all the time on another profile that you don't know anything about. But and I let's just be honest, that's a beautiful camel toe. Babe, I was finished that she was okay with that. To be honest, I don't regret it at all. Uh, Cooking <laughs> with a camel toe is a talent, and it is a gift. No, I told her she unblocked you. I, mean, I, I, she unblocked I thought you. she had more comedy chops no, she had, than but that. But I think in this phase of her life... She wasn't in the mood She wasn't to, ready and in the mood uh, yeah. for you. This is her cock moment. You know, you had your cock, your that cock was, moment. Well, that's why this was her cock moment. That was exactly what I went through. It's just at least... I had, I don't know how she feels about the fact she that was we're wearing all black. It now. Yeah, it's you know, beautiful. What I actually the, really thought I mean, it's and funny. I, Cooking I was, with a camel toe is a talent. It's I was going to crop the pot out <laughs> because I didn't want people to think that she was loaded. She might get more sponsors because that pot looks it's expensive. So considerate. Yeah, you yes. really considerate. And I sent it to her privately. I didn't put it on a public forum. No, but this is why I just I am I'm really yeah. just using this moment in my uh, yes, platform. Yes, you just thought you'd try to and be bring edgy. you guys together. Yeah. I know. I'd love well, to be I'll, friends with her. I'll how, how good, how, you know, I'm a kind human. Because I even said to the owners of my fan park, I'm obsessed with this girl, and they 
got a, a happy birthday video for Lily from her before I know, that. I know, before I, I sent that. Anyway, I'm devastated that she doesn't follow me anymore. No, and she. And I I convinced her to follow you again. I will. I was just like because not, I, know, I could have snogged. That was when was I had funny. 950 followers. I'm now. I don't need it. So just no, keep you your keep your <laughs> camel toe to yourself, <laughs> Aleta Frontena. De camel toe. No, I. <laughs> I love her. I love her. She's one of the best things that happened that's happened to Afrikaans comedy um, in a it while. Really is. Well, I um, just I thought I would just bring you guys together. I, I had a I feeling have... there was going to be a curveball because I've watched all six of your videos and I thought <laughs> there's got to be something. She's going to come up with something, and there it is. Well, Lily, uh, <laughs> I really do appreciate you. Lisa. You're one of the drag queens I look up to. And uh, yes, did they, sister, they see this? Oh, they see this? Sister, I am fucking hate you. So, Bitch. where's your nails? Oh my god, is oh, that what no. you call that? Is fucking um, that's why I keep my hands really busy. <laughs> <laughs> You should do that with your whole face. I didn't want to wear nails. You should do that with your face. You should just get a We should just bite one off and just flick it down your throat. I saw what you did to that auntie that day. That was disgusting. What? When you clipped your nail off and you actually. Now, guys, we've got me daddy in. Here in the dunker cascade, but he's. We've got me daddy in. I say, but how die any key for my ass, please? You must have done so luck. But almost, I said, I'm going to in. There's a null funnel. Okay. She thought it was a bit of nest quick so or yeah, no. nest slide. No, yeah. thanks. Oh. You keep your own nails. Thank you. Oh, very much. Yeah. God, Can I can't I... wait to just get out of this fucking place. Mm. I'm just teasing. I love you, darling. And I wish you most success with your career coming up because you're still new. Uh, you're still actually new in the zoo. I'm very young. And you are very, very <laughs> young. Very, and you're still nice and, and tight. Oh. And you're still tight. You're tight. young and you're tight. Um, and I just wish you sell, sold out shows in all those one horse towns that you love going to. I really just wish you the best of luck with your career, darling. I know, but I really do. I really, really do. And you're doing your own makeup very beautifully. Shut there. the fuck up now. It's enough. That's enough. Go back to your <laughs> caravan. Go perform at Beefcakes and do your thing. Okay? Thanks very much. You've got this, baby. Give me your hand. You've got this. This was the moment. Oh, God, where's the Vix? Where's the Vix? Vix, Vix. Okay, I'm bored now. Bye-bye. <laughs> Dankzij Juice kan ons hierdie show produce. Besoek hulle website www.juice.co.za en bestel jou parfum vandag nog. Hy is halfpad, want ek saai pom, ek dr- ek Alles, ek doen alles met hierdie bottelkie. Hier selfs lipstick boos, so jy kan nie dink <laughs> wat ek met hom doen. Selfs een badplak op hierdie stadium um, van die tour. So, uh, baie dankie, Juice. Dankie, jylle luister. Uh, Juice.co.za